All right, are we? Uh, this isn't a formation lap, is it? This is no, the start of the race. Here we go. Oh, start. Hugo starting on pole. Sergio starting in P2. Sergio's trying to go around the outside. Oh, US takes it three wide into side. turn one. Speedy does manage to get third place. Anonymous up the hill. Fourth from Etnik in fifth. Bantz in sixth. Oh, Hugo's hit the wall. Hey, Hugo hit the wall. Hugo's hit the wall pretty hard by the sounds of oh, it. Oh, oh, he got hit again. Oh, and he's struggling now with lack of front downforce being passed by his teammate. His Bantz, I think, is going to go through as well. He's going to really struggle to get that back to the pit lane. But it's Sergios on the ultra soft tyres instead of the hyper soft that most of the front uh, 10 is on. Sergios oh, leading alongside me for this broadcast. I was expecting to do an intro and I didn't get to do one. So sorry about that. Alongside me for the broadcast is Triton and uh, taking Hello, a break everyone. from the Ferrari. Hi Triton. And uh, wow, quite a, quite a first lap. Oh, that was a, that was a start. I think you go, does Hugo have to pit or? Uh, like Hugo definitely has to pit. Yeah, he's got a lot of wing damage. He's understeering oh, a lot. It doesn't really affect him too much because then from here he can still do a two stop. So uh, urinator gets a. Penalty. Yeah, he can. He'll probably um, go into the probably go into these supers, I would imagine. But he'll be right at the back and he'll have to pass a lot of slower cars. Yeah, but then he can. Uh, oh yeah, no, that won't even work. Um, I was gonna say he might be able to. Yeah, he's in the pits. Uh, that's just that's from pole position that sucks yeah complete disaster hit the wall up the hill at the uh, Massonet corner at the left hander someone who's not going to have to worry about slowing past a car uh, passing slower cars is Sergios who's going around lows right now and he's already got a lead over speedy of just over a second and on the ultra soft tires I mean you'd have to think that he's just going to run into the distance at this point he's going to have much less tire wear than everyone else The one who benefited most, though, Speedy just went up from, uh, I think, fifth place. He's up in the second now into the podium. Yeah, he and got he got a really he got a really good start. He was third, I think, out of turn one, and then obviously Hugo hit the wall. As Doxter gets himself a penalty already on lap two for uh, corner cutting, repeated offences. And we got Ocean Chief. Oh, Ocean Chief has spun. I think it looks like he hit the inside barrier at the chicane. So he's... Uh, 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 ethnic left. I oh, what happened to... Out. Is he disconnected? What happened to him? Uh, I think he disconnected, but it says he's out. Um, yeah, uh, he's there passing him through now. Yeah, I think that's uh, it. Yeah. So uh, ethnic is a ghost, so he's going to fall down the order. What a disaster for Sauber after a really strong qualifying and a really strong race last weekend. It's uh, all gone wrong for them this weekend. So speedy... Now two and a half seconds behind Sergios in the lead and Sergios is stretching his legs. Anonymous, who is on a wheel for the first time this weekend, no longer the keyboard racer. And you can see the benefit that having a wheel gives you at Monaco. He's uh, pressuring Speedy for that second place. Yeah, you gotta hand it to him as well. Like, he adjusted to the wheel really quickly. Yeah. Which surprised me because it takes a lot. It usually takes a few days or so, but he did it, like, almost instantly, so... Yeah, absolutely. He's uh, really, uh, really put a lot of work in to be to be fast first on the keyboard and then on the wheel. And yeah, he's all over the back now of Speedy. Well, not quite all over the back, but certainly within that one second window. He's got DRS now on second place. Speedy Bance is fourth. Bance has had a nice uh, low key start to this race. Still got his front oh, wing yeah, by the looks of it. And uh, someone we've not talked about. I think his debut for this. Uh, for this league, Smokin' Cheese 86, who I've not seen before, to be completely honest. We've got a few regulars missing, and uh, well, you're one of them, Triton. You're uh, you're not in the yeah, Ferrari this weekend, but uh, but certainly quite a few people. And Smokin' Cheese is one of the reserves, and he's uh, had a pretty good start to this race. He's uh, he's catching Benz pretty good. Yeah, cool. yeah, he's. I think uh, is struggling now. I imagine he's just uh, he's backed off his pace a little bit either that or he's got a little bit of front wing damage but i can't see any but i don't know uh it doesn't look like any damage from my yeah. end but um i think the problem is is like now you're gonna see like the top drivers or whoever's on the ultra softs or hyper softs i mean um they're gonna start to struggle for pace because they start to die out around this time and in a couple laps mm. they're gonna be making the pit stops oh and then we might, we might see over the chicane i don't know if he hit the wall on the exit but it looked like he might have done 
And Speedy's made a mistake this lap as well. He's now got Anonymous all, all over the back of him. Might, uh, might overtake Doxer right now. Oh. He's going to have DRS now. Oh, okay, they touched a bit. There, he's going to have DRS now going into the start finish straight here. Uh, Not quite close really enough at the center Oh, yeah, Jesse out of the pit lane. Oh. My goodness. Good yeah, reactions Jesse from the Doxter. Um, that could have been bad, though. But at Monaco, it is a long, long race, and you just got to stay out of trouble some of the time. So uh, this is right on the back of Speedy as well. Yeah, right he now. really is, and Bance is all over the back now as well. Yeah. Speedy is really struggling. He must have. Yeah, he's holding them up. Sergio's got an eight-second gap. I think Speedy is missing front downforce. I think he's missing a little bit of his left-sided front wing. Oh yeah, he's missing. So Speedy very slow. Eight seconds now behind Sergios. Anonymous and Bantz yeah, will just follow along here with Bantz for a little bit because uh, he's got a front row seat of this battle for second place between oh, Speedy man, and yes. Anonymous. So the yeah, he is really, really struggling. He's lost a second in half a lap to Sergios up front. He's got a queue oh, yeah, of cars behind him. Oh, he's gone wide too, to the corner. Uh, we might have him here. Uh, I don't think it's enough though, that's the thing, even with DRS. Yeah, it's so, so to difficult really to overtake. Oh, Bantz goes a bit deep into the corner, gets oh, away with it. Uh, we got Sane in the pits, and also Doxter in the pits as well, in the Ferrari, so... He's gonna yeah, he's be... New front wing. Yeah, new front wing by the looks of it. So, I'm looking at Hugos as well, Hugos is now stuck behind Ocean Chief, and this is the problem with having an incident on lap one, is that now he's stuck behind slower cars, so pretty much at the whole of the first stint. Not going to be able to make any headway whatsoever. I would think Ocean might see him and let him through because he's usually lenient with those. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Up, but he might want to battle. Oh, Anonymous well. is Anonymous past Speedy. We missed that on track, but Anonymous oh, has passed oh, Speedy, man. and Bantz now as well is going to pass Speedy, and is Speedy letting people through? Oh, and an oh, accident! And a Bantz spins across the chicane. Speedy. Well, oh, I didn't really nice get a great yeah, view of that. Damage. I think Bantz has got, I mean, Speedy obviously has got wing damage. I think Bantz probably has now as well. We'll yeah, see. Yeah, but this isn't, I mean, this could have been worse because now he has to pit anyways. But now Smoke mm. and Cheese is on Speedy right now as well. And Speedy's probably going to have to yeah, pit as well because he, he might have wing damage as well. So yeah, Speedy he's going in as does well pit. Bantz does not pit, so maybe Bantz got away with it. I'm not sure he hit anything front on, as it were. He got hit from behind. I can see, I can see front wing missing. And I, I think, because okay. I know he hit the wall when he spun. Uh, but I don't know how severe it is. Yeah, Speedy's getting a new front wing and he's going on to Super... Uh, I think he's going on to Ultras, because it's uh, showing up weird for me. I don't know, it looks like Supers to me. Yeah, he's on Super Soft. Yeah, it showed up Ultras yeah. for me. Uh, okay, no, he no. goes up in place, actually, and he's on Super Soft, so he only has to stop one more time. Yeah, from the so back of the grid. That's, yeah, uh, that's, the, that's the problem with Monaco, is mm. if you one stop on this track, like even if you're at the back, you're gonna, you can just hold up the faster cars. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we were talking earlier, I think, about the... How, or especially with Sergius doing the one stop, um, how it might be effective. Um, for him, it's worked out well because everyone just kind of started taking each other out behind. Mm. But um, yeah, this it just gives you s track position in the end as opposed to the beginning. But Ants is still catching him, actually. Yeah, he is. Right. It does kind of look like he's struggling for downforce. I don't know. He might just be he's trying to stretch the tires because, I mean, it might be better for him to stay out, honestly, because. Now uh, he's pits oh, now, he's and now. so yeah, does Smoke and Cheese. That's uh, that's bad luck. Smoke and Cheese is going in as well. Maybe yeah, he jumps maybe in, in the pits. He, um, yeah, he's gonna take a wing too. I don't think Smoke and Cheese has to. So yeah, he's gonna be well ahead of him. Yep, Smoke and Cheese straight out. No wing change. Uh, Bantz does change his wing. So I wonder where uh, he's gonna come out. Around the corner here now. So oh, he Speedy hits the wall on the exit of Rascas. And Bantz, I think, will be out. Uh, it'll be really close between him and Speedy, so we might have a renewed uh, battle. Okay, um, Ocean Chief's in the pits, so now he goes past him. Okay, so Speedy is ahead of Bantz. Bantz is not going to be happy. It's the wall on the inside of the corner. Hopefully he doesn't take damage from that. It's the bad time to take damage when you've just pitted. Yippo. Wow, okay. Um, depending on how much of a gap he can make here, though, he and Tipsy both can end up, like, uh, up... Into, um, yeah, yeah. Here. I mean, I mean, they're gonna have they're gonna have a queue of cars behind them quite soon. I think smoke and cheese and. Michael. Yeah, yeah, it's true. But it's, I uh, think I think this is unless Sergio's um, 
makes a big error, then I think this is looking pretty good for him. Oh, Sergio has yeah, absolutely, now. absolutely won the race. There's no doubt about that. I think unless he puts it in the wall. I mean, he, it can happen at Monaco. I mean, anyth anything can happen at Monaco. So anonymous pitch from P2 gets in, gets himself a new front wing as well. So I wonder, he's he's going to come out in traffic. I'm not sure about that from anonymous. On the back of smoke and cheese now, um, trying to reclaim the position. Jesse holds him up a bit, going into the pits now. Um, okay, he's got DRS, but I don't think he's going to be able to get enough of a run on him. It's so difficult to overtake. Though, so maybe if he gets next time. Yeah, he's got the fresher tires. Smoke and cheese though with the. Get held up anonymous just comes out. Oh, anonymous comes out in front of them. That's a really, really fortunate for anonymous that he managed to clear those yeah, two he... cars. They're going to catch Sane in a bit, though. I think. Yes, Sane's up at uh, the hairpin right now. Six seconds, yeah. Gets another penalty, so. See, I'll follow on board with the two Force Indias through the slow bits into the tunnel now. Oh, you know we missed? Oh, um, Jippo, I think Jippo got past Tipsy, actually. Oh, oh he did, course. yeah. He was running behind yeah, him, wasn't he? he? Yeah. So Jippo yeah, up to behind third. Him behind him. I think I don't know if Tipsy let him pass or not, but um, I'll have to review that after. But the job on Jippo, he's in the podium now. If he can just keep it smooth and keep the pace going on the on the supers, he can come out and jump probably a handful of those guys who were on hypers earlier. Yeah, Sane right up behind Tipsy now for P4 as well. So uh, as Urinator gets himself a penalty, he has a look up the inside into Sandovot. Nothing doing though. He's right on him up the hill though. They head up towards Massonet. Might go for it into uh, Massonet. Oh, oh, he's hit him. Oh, but no damage, luckily. Um, like he Tipsy didn't. Tries the switch back. He's uh, tries the outside in Casino Square. Tipsy covers the inside for Mirabeau. As they head down the hill, oh, this through Mirabeau really into Lowe's. He's really gonna have a lunge. He's not gonna have a lunge. He's got to be patient at Monaco because there's nothing worse than trying to get past somebody and finding yourself in the wall and without a front wing. Meanwhile, Bance is right on uh, Speedy's tail again, and oh. I don't think he's too happy with how it the last time, so he, he's yeah. probably going to go after him. He's on uh. super softs, and uh, Bance is on ultras, and they both have to make another pit stop probably after this. So Bance is going to want to pass him and then build a gap, and then maybe catch Anonymous. Yeah, I wonder if Speedy's going to have to pit again. Speedy's not great on tires, so he might have to pit again. Well, smoking those, oh, ahead and Bance of, clouds yeah, the wall into back. Uh, oh yeah, he was because he was, he was running yeah, behind Anonymous. Him. Yeah, so so both of them have passed him. Both of them have passed him. In fact, oh, both Speedy and Vance. Okay, now going into this corner, Vance needs to maximize his exit, and he doesn't uh, really do no so chance. Bad. Too he's, far he's behind. He's got DRS, so he'll catch him. But once again, up the hill, and there's a lapper in the way as well. It's one of the I think it's Jesse who's in the way. Oh, Tipsy runs wide and side by side, and he puts Sane in the wall a little bit into Casino Square. They come out, I don't think either of them got any damage, but there was definite contact. Tipsy coming back across the track. Insane oh, all over the back way. of him. Okay. Um, yeah, Speedy and Vance are... Just, or he's kind of just holding him up in a sense, because Vance looks like he's got more pace, but he's just not able to pass. Yeah. And each time he gets to these areas, like he, the wheel spin is just so crazy, because the traction in Monaco is pretty wild. Oh, but Vance has got a good run on him. He might be able to get him now. Got a real him. run. This is where he got him last he's time, before Speedy inside. hits he's him. Speedy goes to the inside. Uh, he late breaking, uh, he kind of, uh, he didn't break in time, uh, Speedy defends it very well. Yeah, he did defend it well, he was on the inside and there's no real way you can go around the outside there unless you break a lot later than the other person, no chance really for Bance to do that. They're and gonna catch, uh, uh, yeah, I mean, they're gonna catch Anonymous because he's gonna get held up by Sane and Tipsy right now, and then, um, there's just gonna be a five car train here. Yep, and Michael and just now, looking Speedy's in such a good DR position. Now, and that'll help him, but he's gotta get it right now, oh, he's got a good run on him though. Oh, uh, Bance right on him, side against. by side, round the outside, can he get in and send the oh, Up the hill, him, gets the hit. traction, yeah, I think he's got him. Nicely done. Yeah, there you go, great move from Bance. Oh, um, and Mac Jagley, uh, this is DNF. Or Mac Jagley, my apologies. Oh, he's at the wall, uh, at, uh... Is that uh, Raskas? Let's have yeah, a look. Yeah, Raskas, he's at the wall. Ah, uh, um, Radios is about to pass him. And oh, yeah, there he is, wow, on the outside, Sergios as well, wow, my goodness. 
That would have been a big issue. Race leader, yeah. yeah. Sergius is almost a full 30. He's almost... Oh, Urinator as well retires. Oh, Urinator's gone straight on at the oh, chicane. The wall too. Yeah, uh, he's gone straight on at the chicane. Not sure quite how that There's happened. Besides uh, Ethnic TRN, who unfortunately I think he disconnected. Yeah, yeah, I think so too. But lap, lap 13 until the first real retirement is a good show from uh, the SRL crowd. But there's a train of cars now, all behind yeah, okay. Tipsy. Guys right now, and then if he passes them, he'll be in the clear for third, um, and then he can catch Jippo and get on a podium. Yeah. Oh, same uh, yeah, pits. That'll Saint help him a pits. lot. That'll Does help him a lot. Saint have damage? Uh, probably oh, not. It might be. Uh, oh yeah, he got a. Uh, he got. A, yeah, he, oh, he's, he's like changing his front wing. I mean, the yeah, five-second penalty probably not that huge a deal unless there's a safety car it's gonna be a pretty spread out field oh up the hill speedy and bants bants yeah in uh Massonet. not able to get it done though bants has big damage yeah, he's got he's missing a bit of front wing so he's gonna be slow a bit too again oh dear I don't know where he hit it but uh, he's catching tipsy though uh, yeah right up behind tipsy anyways, he's, he's got more pace and he's got the fresher tires as well tipsy's been on those supers since the start of the race does get some traction now, and now he's right behind Tips. But again, it's just not quite enough. Doxer get gets himself a penalty for corner cutting. Anonymous is catching uh, Hugo now. Um, Hugo kind of he's salvaging it, so he's not out of it yet, and that's a shame from pole position, especially. Oh, but. Tipsy! Tip something happened to Tipsy. Tipsy went off, I think, at Tabak, and I think he's limping. He's going to have to pit. He's oh lost yeah, a he's bunch missing. of his front wing. Oh, so tipsy into the wall. And yeah, he does go into the pit lane. He's going to have to make a second pit stop as, oh, Hugo nearly hits it or loses it going onto the start finish straight. As, uh, oh, speedy side by side with Bantz has oh, continued Bantz the battle from earlier. And, and, and yeah, a corner cutting penalty for Bantz. So from so, yeah, P4. I don't think speedy has one yet, so he'll be good. So uh, Radios gets one as well. Um, I don't know if we mentioned it, but we're using strict corner cutting for this race. We usually use yep. the regular, but um, since Monaco is uh, through uh, Sandoval, you can get a oh. pretty easy overtake through there without getting a corner cutting warning. So yep. we decided we go strict. Yeah, Sane gets so one as well for Sane gets one as well for Sandoval corner cut. But, uh, I'm gonna keep an eye on this battle for fourth though. Bant Speedy and Hugo's now joining them as well. And yeah, I, uh, now, uh, yeah, Smoke and Cheese is right on the back of uh, Copy, who I don't think has done a pit stop yet. Yeah, he's not. Or, uh, he's done one stop, yeah, but uh, Smoke and Cheese is on He's on a new set of Super Softs, I think, or Ultra Softs, my apologies, but um, he made a second pit stop earlier. I think he had to get um, uh, I think he had to get a wing change again. Oh, okay. So yeah, he's yeah he's about a, he's about a pit stop behind his teammate now because uh, they were running together, and now he's 20 seconds behind, so yeah, that does make sense. Here's Radio outside of the pit seat. Uh, Bance just passes him, so that's good. But uh, I don't think... Oh, I don't think Speedy's going to get past him. And Sp oh, Radio Speedy. spins and he hits Speedy. Speedy's hit him and he's got a penalty as well. Oh, Speedy gets oh, a penalty. He swing. Yeah, uh, Radio's hit the wall coming out of the pit plane. And then Bance just got past him and then uh, he Speedy hit him. So I think he's... Yeah, he might have a bit of understeer. I'm not too sure. But he's going to want to carry on because I don't think it's that severe. Oh, he's fallen way off the back of Bance. He's uh, two yeah, seconds okay. behind now. He's also got wing damage too, so... Yeah, this might yeah. Just even it out. And Hugo they both have to do one more stop, if I'm correct. So, if Vance can just uh, keep the gap, he should be in the clear. But the uh, the two people who've stayed out of trouble, is, I mean, as well as Sergios, who's going to win the race, barring something weird, but Michael and Jippo, both of them, stayed out of trouble, are now running second and third, so they've reaped the rewards of that. Jippo right at the back he started, because he had a grid penalty, and I think he was 13th before his grid penalty, so uh, he started, what, 17th or 18th, something like that, right at the back, anyway, now in third. If the, yeah, if he can keep this gap, because everyone has to hit one more time, I think, behind him. Um, so, if he can, if, I, I'm not sure he'll be able to hold Vance back so, for so long, but Vance is getting a lap car in his way, who might give him a bit of leeway, or Jippo some leeway. Yeah, but, um, well, presumably Michael Vance will have to pit clear, again so as well. Podium. Yeah, he's had a pretty rough season too, so that would be really good for him. He's also very slowly catching Sergios. I wonder if Sergios did take damage from that incident we saw with uh, Mac Jagley at oh, yeah, Rascas. Sergio's missing front wing. I can see it. Yeah. Okay. Just a bit, though. I'm not sure if it's too much. See if we can uh, take a look at that. 
Yeah, he is missing a little bit, isn't he? Or Doxter with a DNF. What happened there? I think Doxter just hit the wall somewhere. Just gonna keep an eye on. Uh, gloves and steering. Uh, gloves and steering. You know, yeah, I'm steering. on board with gloves oh. and steering, trying to see what happened yeah. to the Doxter. Oh, meanwhile, there's a train here. Speedy Hugos is right on Speedy's tail, and um, so is Anonymous. Oh, it's at uh, um, the first part of the swimming pool is where is where Doxter crashed. But yeah, uh, this uh, yeah. this is a train. Speedy holding people up. He's four seconds off the back of Bance now. Bance right on the back of Jippo yeah. as well. Oh, he's hit the wall to a bit on uh, coming into Rescast, and now mm -hmm. out of Anthony knows um, Hugo gets a pretty good run here. He might be able to get the DRS on him into um, overtake mode. He's he does have the DRS, but again, enough. not quite close enough. You've got to be so close at Monaco to make it stick. And it's just not so difficult to pass, even when the car behind, oh, oh, car in front is several seconds right slower. Yeah, anonymous as well. Anonymous. Oh, and Speedy close the wall. He's out of the race. Oh, what a disaster for Speedy for the championship. Speedy, who was doing so well. I don't. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. But he certainly he hit the inside barrier. I think at the at Casino Square and just absolutely clouded the outside wall and lost his wheel that is a dnf oh, oh that's such a shame so far that's i think speedy's first of the season yeah it definitely is he's uh that's gonna give sergio such a good um haul of points in the championship too yeah yeah i believe they're tied in terms of wins um speedy won the first three rounds and then um sergio has won uh in baku spain and if he wins this they'll be tied oh jippo just got himself a penalty from third place so uh I think that's his first oh, one though, and I think Bantz right only on has field. one as well. Yeah, oh, right Bantz yeah. right around the outside, he has got him easily really into Sandoval. Very nicely and done from Bantz. So if it stays like this, Bantz will be on course for the podium. Well, he needs to pit again though, so I guess everyone else does as well. Maybe with the exception oh, of Sane. I mean, uh, he was getting a slow stream on him, but now he's going to probably back out because um, yeah, like he's on got more pace to the corners. Yeah, he's, he's already wide. He's on um, very old tyres, Jippo. He's uh, been on these tyres since the start of the race, and they are super soft, so they're slow anyway. Battle still rages on behind for fifth and sixth, though Hugos and Anonymous into Lowe's hairpin. Oh, yeah, he is, isn't he, Tipsy? He's uh, having a quiet race. He's, yeah, he's no, got those uh, got those ultra softs on, and he's going to be good now for a while. Maybe not sure about to the end of the race. It probably is a little bit too long, but Tipsy's quite good on tyres, so maybe he can make it last to the end of the race. I don't know. And 24 laps on the ultras seems like a long time, though. Anonymous right on the back of Hugo's here through the swimming pool. His tires are really old too. He's been on those since lap one. Yeah. He has. Oh, and Jesse gets a five second. And, an and then another for, three uh, second for corner cut A. Yeah. And then cutting the corner as well. Yeah. So Jesse having a struggle out there in the McLaren. He's a yeah, long he's way behind. I think he's just on a race of his own at this point. He's three minutes behind Sergio. Yeah, he is, which is Ooh, almost so three laps. At this point. He is 28 seconds ahead of Michael, and he hasn't even stopped yet. So, in fact, he's three minutes behind the car in front of him, which is Etnik TRN, <laughs> or the ghost of Etnik TRN. So uh, he's Meanwhile, nearly four laps down. I think Vance will. If Vance can oh. catch Michael. Oh, Tipsy side place. by side with Smoke and Cheese into turn one. Not able to pass though. Smoke and Cheese covered the inside very nicely. Up the hill to oh, the yeah. Massonet. Yeah. Um, if he can get a good run into Mirabeau, no, he's not going to be able to. He that missed the now. apex at Casino Square, didn't he? Uh, gets another, another penalty for Jippo. That might Meanwhile, matter come the end of the race. Uh, he's kind of leaving a bit of a gap here, but then uh, if he can catch him into the start-finish straight after Anthony knows, he'll be yeah, able to get him. Yeah, here is where uh, it matters. Yeah, Hugo's, Hugo's cut the corner there. He will have got a warning for that, I'm sure. That was uh, the second part of the swimming pool. None uh, of us. This may or may not be enough. No, he's, yeah, I don't think he's, he's, not, he's not close enough. No way. Yeah, and he's not even... Oh, and... Okay. Did I... I thought I just saw a car sideways, but I... Oh, same DNF'd! That was... That must have been what oh, I saw then. Yeah, oh, he's hit the oh in the second half of the swimming pool, yeah. So, uh, Sane out of the race. He was having a really good run. So, another casualty at the swimming pool section. We're down to 15 runners. Well, 14, really, if you count Etnik as a retiree. 
And I guess Synergy also, hasn't started the race. Yeah, I don't know what happened to Synergy either. Synergy got stuck in the pits. I think he just, I think he glitched or desynced or something. Oh, Jippo, okay. oh, Jippo nearly goes wide. Oh, he's sliding all over the place coming into the, into Portier. Well, I have to and imagine. Jippo is going to be right on him. Yeah, I have to imagine that Jippo is going to be pitting quite soon. That'll be a, that'll be a warning for Bant. So you cut the chicane there. As Jippo goes through. He's already catching uh, Michael at a really fast rate though. Uh, I think I believe Michael has to do one pit stop as well. Yeah, we'll keep an eye on that gap. Seven seconds yeah, at Michael the moment. Yeah, Michael hasn't stopped yet. So I'm 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 convinced that uh, Vance will be able to catch him. He's got a lot of pace to give here. Yeah, it and depends when. I imagine Michael will be pitting soon. It um, depends when he pits, I guess. Yeah, but, meanwhile, uh, Hugo's is right on uh, Chippo's tail. Yeah, I've been watching this for the last uh, half a lap or so. Tipsy as well, all over the back of Smoke and Cheese. We'll keep an eye on that too, but uh, this is the real battle right now. Jippo, who's on very old tyres. Hugo's also on very old tyres, actually. Anonymous on slightly fresher tyres that he put on on lap uh, eight or so. Those ultra softs. Now, what Jippo could do here, actually, um, if I were in his situation, I would just keep going as much as I could. And, and then... Um, when the pit stops come, everyone might end up hitting at the same time. Maybe... He, oh, the rain, I see... Rain already? Oh, my goodness. We were yeah, expecting rain... Oh, this is going to take... Oh, Michael might not have to pit. At the Michael end won't. of the race. Yeah, wow. So it's uh, it's worth it then to keep your tires oh, for as long as you can. Let's copy pits oh, from... going to be a loss of work here. What yeah, I think was nine. Trying to slide around already. Gippo as well. Oh, um, Bant's really struggling in Raskas. To get the car turned in. We might see some uh, incidents again here. Yeah, I'm going to keep my eye very closely on this battle for fourth, fifth, and sixth because I think this is the likeliest oh, point oh, for something to happen. As Hugo almost loses it on traction. Oh, and he might lose out to Anonymous. And Anonymous. Anonymous he yeah, he did back right out of it, but so treacherous. I think he was too early on the DRS. He didn't have the traction, and then when he went on the DRS, he, um, it sent him a bit wide. Yeah. Our radios gets another penalty. It's like, like I don't even know how many. These guys that are on old tires as well. These guys that are on old tires as well. They've been struggling yeah, for grip yeah. anyway, and now it starts raining. So, a real yeah, nightmare scenario. Really, uh, you can see the puddle or the like the layer of water starting to form. Mm. Oh, DRS disabled, so it's 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 Inter's yeah. time already, and Tipsy oh, yeah, yeah, has yeah, pitted. He didn't. He made the he made the right choice. Yeah, he's, absolutely. He's getting a new wing as well, and it doesn't matter because he's so far in the lead. Um, yeah. Oh, well, Ocean Chief's out. Oh, what Ocean happened to Ocean Chief? Chief? Oh, no. We missed what happened to him. We're going we're gonna to uh, go on board. On board with, yeah, I'm going to go on board with... Hitting the wall again. He's got no looks, like, looks like it's swimming pool. So Ocean Chief is in looks, the wall yeah, in the swimming pool section. Oh, and so many people struggling. And Gloves and steering wheel <laughs> spins out at the chicane as well. Oh, Etnik well, TRN pits for Inters. Michael pits. Bant just about gets it turned around at Raskas. He oh, pits as well. So it came so suddenly and nearly half of the race is going to be wet. Uh, if you think about it, I was thinking about China. I remember there was a long period where nobody was switching to the Inters and where yeah. people were. It didn't seem so quick since the rain was so slow. But now it seems like there's a really... Oh, Jeffo's getting a new wing. And um, yep, so he this is. might change up the order. When it, when I don't know if... I didn't see if Bant's got a new wing. I well. have to imagine Bant's did get a new wing. He's out in third place. Uh, the other thing that Ocean Chief said when he gave me the weather report for this race is that it's heavy rain at the end of the race. Oh, so, no, so they're going to have to go up So the they wet. might have to, oh. yeah, they might have to do that. Yeah, Bance didn't change his front wing. So he's, oh, Bance goes a little bit wide. And yeah, the, we're going to see a lot of sliding in the back end now, especially depending on how uh, Monaco is. Um, even at this stage of the race, or... Well, now it doesn't really matter since the rain is here. Um, the grip is pretty much gone now. It's pretty yeah. washed off. Anonymous so, um, came out in front of Flying Jippo. Jippo's all over the back of Anonymous. Oh, but but, uh, oh he's going oh, to. We hit the wall on the inside, I think, there. On the inside of the first part of the Casino Square. Uh, As I look down the inside, down the inside into Bobo! Side oh, by he's side! He's and he's and through! He's Fantastic move from Jippo. Got got it done on the inside, yeah, fantastic. I told I t I mentioned it earlier. Jippo is really good in the rain. Um, whenever we play um, practice rounds or whatever. Hmm. 
Well, he's Brazilian, having a, but then in the rain, I'm like half a second slower. He's so, having, yeah, yeah, he's having such he's a fantastic, really uh, such a fantastic race, starting from the back, as we said, which is usually a death yeah, sentence at Monaco. Yeah, he started like 18th, but uh, Hugo also benefited greatly from this, from last and out of and disappointment. He's back up into fourth place. And yeah, he may or may not be able to put up the bands, but um, bands meanwhile has to catch Michael, who's benefited as well from this. Because he's up in the second place. Yeah, pretty much and anyone who second. who managed to, and maybe that was maybe that was why those guys decided to go, or it's why, why Sergios and a couple of others decided to go for the ultras instead of the hypers to get them to this pit window, and it certainly worked yeah, for like, for them. Yeah, that's a good point, especially for um, um smoking cheese. I saw him try to we saw him try to do super softs in qualifying. Maybe mm. that was what he was trying to do because at this point the super softs would be pretty close to dead as well. But um, yeah. For Michael, you, uh, hats off to Michael as well, making the super, uh, the ultra sauce last for so long. Um, I don't think they should have lasted 20 something laps. Or the tire wear here is not so bad, but it would give you a trouble, uh, some trouble at the end. So yep. again, great job. And the Vance is starting to catch him. So this battle for seventh between Tipsy and Smoking Cheese, which has been going on for quite a while on both dry and wet weather tires, actually coming up to catch the person, I think. Yeah, the person... Oh no, it's not. It's not copied. It's directly in front of them. I thought it was. It was uh, like catching, catching them on track. Yeah, Sergios. Sergios it is who's a lap in front. But uh, This looks like the closest battle at the moment. I think we're going to see a battle for second very shortly between Michael and Bance because Bance does look like Bantz. he's quite a lot faster. For ninth place, we also have a battle here on gloves and steering wheel of one of the... Um, Reserve drivers, he's right on the back of Copy right now. Copy's struggling mm. in the rain a bit. Um, it seems like he's going a lot more easier on uh, gloves and steering wheel. And Copy's losing the back end or the back end a bit. And he's about to, or he's about to get him on <laughs> the sharp end straight, maybe with the slipstream. Yeah, it's so difficult though, because of course in the rain no DRS, so you've got to yeah. you've got to do it just with a run out of the last corner. It's uh, oh, Tixi's hit the wall out of a. Uh, 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 before Raskas and into Anthony Noge. Um, oh. I don't think he's got a good enough run yet, um, Smoke and Cheese. Yep, he's uh, uh, a off. few car lengths behind still. Oh, and Smoke and Cheese, yeah, he oh, did He did cut the penalty. corner, yeah, he cut the corner at Sandovart, so uh, he gets himself a penalty. That's going to help Tipsy a bit. But he is really catching up uh, Tipsy. He might end up um, giving him some trouble in the end, but then Tipsy, all mm -hmm. he has to do is just keep within three seconds, because I don't think he has a penalty yet. Yeah, well, it's difficult to keep track of the penalties. I don't know. Uh, and uh, Jesse gets yeah. himself another one. Oh, and Jesse DNFs. Jesse DNFs. Jesse just hit the wall. Didn't see where, but yeah, he's uh, he's out of the race. That's for sure. So uh, Ethnic might get actually get points if, he, if there's two more retirements. <laughs> um, Ethnic might get points from ghosting. <laughs> I don't know what the legal uh, rules yeah, are uh, about well, that. But, well, uh, Vance is catching Michael. Yeah, he's right on the back of him. Um, yeah. Oh, and Radios is there. He was going to back him up a bit as well. Um, so uh, he's gained, what, two seconds in the last lap or so. And Vance now sniffing out this second place. Had a oh, relatively Radios clean race. Hold, hold him up a bit because oh. Radios can't really give up AI for a minute. As he uh, moves right to the side, that's uh, nice driving from Radios, gets himself out of the way. Yeah, we talked about this earlier, um, it's really hard to move in some of the parts of this track, so if you mm. catch somebody like there into the, uh, uh, the chicane, or not oh, the chicane, as Bant does doesn't down. get it slowed down and gets and himself a penalty, slowed. yeah. Oh, that's, oh, that's such a shame. It's uh, um, bad luck. He's, he has a handful of laps to do this though, so he can build a gap afterwards. He just has to take it easy, but the heavy rain is here, if you can see it. Yeah, the heavy it's definitely heavy now, so these guys are going to really struggle. I wonder if, I mean, do you pit for wets at this point? I don't know, you lose track position if you pit for wets, but... I would wait for the call. Yeah. I'd wait for the call. I, uh, if the, intermediate, the intermediates are, in general, faster, like, to an extent in the heavy rain, it's just... Mm. Um, I think you just, uh, the problem is, is that you just have to go slower, and it essentially slows you down, but... In general, it's, I mean, we all know that the intermediates are fairly quicker, so you'd want to stay on them for a Okay. Absolutely have. Yeah. The wet time can start to fall down even. And it'll be about 20 seconds slower than uh, the pole position at black times. 
or even more if I'm correct. Uh, Smoke not, and so. Cheese did manage to get past Tipsy. We missed it um, on track, oh. but that happened Tipsy just has, at um, some point. He needs to keep the gap though. Yeah, I'm not sure he's going to be able to though. I think he is losing. Yeah, he's oh, he's he's missing tons of his front wing. In fact, you can see oh, he's, yeah, he's struggling so much to turn in. Him. Yeah, I don't know. We we didn't see it. I mean, he hit the wall a couple of times when he was in front of him. Uh, Smoke and cheese pits. Is this for wets? This must be for wets. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. They, no, they have intermediates. Right they have inters. Oh, that that might that might be a glitch. Um, yeah, we will I'm see. Uh, looks like they are inters. Yep, looks uh, like they are into front wing he though. Have waited. Yeah, even Tipsy's in for, um, a, yeah, setup, um, for, for a for yeah, a front wing. It's a front wing change for both of them, so they must have made contact somewhere, must have hit the wall or each other uh, they or something. Have waited, them. I would have taken it slow and then gone in for yeah, the Yeah, they, um, the, they were both the quite Oh, it was Michael Pitts. Michael Pitts from P two. So Bantz uh, inherits yeah, that P two. Yeah. Yep. He might have called it too early, let's see. Um Ugos is also going up ahead too. So yeah, Michael also with a front wing change. Seems like everyone who's come into the pits has had to change their front wing. I guess it's not yeah, that surprising. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, Jippo's in the pits, so, or not Jippo, that's uh, Radio, so I'm sorry. Um, yeah. But Jippo is going into the pits as well. He might get held up though, his teammate's there. Yeah, oh, his no, teammate. Okay, yeah. I think he's alright. He, it, it'll, it'll, it'll be a slow pit stop though, because they'll have to it'll reset. Be a bit slow, but it's not so slow. Yeah. It been worse. And he's it is full, full wets, wets um, for Jippo. Oh, Bantz and. Uh, Oh no, that's Tipsy letting Vance through from the from yeah, a lap car. Yeah, a lap down, yeah. Vance, so, uh, uh, I think Tipsy should have waited, same as Smoke and Cheese. They might lose out to, uh, depending on how far Copy is ahead of him. Or, be, or behind him, Well, Co Copy's a long way behind. He's nearly a, He was oh, nearly a lap behind. Um, he's now less than a lap behind, but still a long way behind because these guys are pitted. So uh, I think... Those two are probably okay, but yeah, Tipsy's fallen right off the bat now with Smoke and Cheese. He's nine seconds back. So that battle looks like it might be over as Bant's... Oh, Bant's struggling so, so, so much, and he's oh. cut another bunch of corners at the swimming oh, pool. He's, like, yeah, he's, he's losing so now. much, he's yeah. I think... No, uh, I wonder if he's gonna... Into the pits he the comes. And Ooh, yeah, and it'll be close with Michael. Hugos does manage to get it slowed down for the, lim for the limiter. Uh, uh, my eyes are on Michael now. Let's see where he comes out. He's well, really it's a, it's a wing change for yeah, Bans. Getting a wing, though. So, so I think he's. I, I don't think he's gonna come out. Um, no wing for Hugos. So Hugos is gonna I jump him. I think. Yeah, he does. So uh, Hugos jumps him in the pit lane, and I think. Hugos, I think is that from last. Yeah, absolutely. Such a good performance. Michael, I think is gonna jump Bans here. Yeah. I don't think he's gonna get Hugos, but I think he's gonna jump Bans. Yeah. As Hugos comes out of the pit lane, Michael just behind, and then Bans behind the pair of them. So but Vance Bantz, can still make this happen. He, he's got yeah, laps. if he can keep his front wing intact for the next what eleven laps or so, it'll be difficult for him. Sergios is now fifty-two seconds ahead of second place. Hugos absolutely uh, dominating performance. Out, behind Jippo. Uh, Jippo's in fifth now. Ah, uh, yeah. So uh, so Jippo gets himself that position. They're both still has twenty seconds or so behind Bantz. Yeah, I wonder, and, and neither is Tipsy, so yeah, both of them deciding to go back on the Inters. They it was obviously a bad call. A here, but, um, something, ha they might just something happened to Tipsy as well, because he's now 16 seconds behind Smoke and Cheese. Oh, oh yeah. Smoke and Cheese does pit from P7. Yeah, he's coming to Wetson. I think Tipsy's going to have to as well here. I would have um, thought so. It's not going to take very many laps yeah, for those wets to pay off. Michael is... Um, he's still fairly close to Hugos. Um, Tipsy does pit. And Bance, oh, Bance hits the wall a bit and he gets another time penalty. Oh over. my goodness. <laughs> Bance uh, in so all scary. sorts of trouble in this race. He's uh, still sec or still fourth somehow, but uh, he's going to have a bunch of penalties by the end of it. Anonymous uh, on the back of Flying Jippo within a second now, so as they go through the swimming pool you can see it's uh, so it's wet. It's a five second knock-go penalty. For both so corner cut, he gets two of them. Did he get a, Did think, he get a second one there as well? Because he certainly, well, he certainly cut the corner after he got the penalty. So it might be that he got another penalty. Yeah, yeah. Once you cut that line, you have to go back to the main track. You can't take mm. the inside of Sandoval. You have to go back to the oh, on the other side of the. Um, oh, I was I was watching Anonymous. Sorry, oh, that Anonymous was gets the past. wrong. Force India Anonymous, Anonymous does get him. Cuts the corner though, and he's going wheel to wheel. 
um, up into up oh he might uh, is he gonna uh, get away with that he yeah he gets back past him he gets, he gets a penalty away. for um, it yeah he got a penalty so it wasn't entirely worth it I don't know if anonymous has one or not but they oh, both sideways in casino square Jippo keeps the position though so Ooh, close between the two of them is that I mean both of them are in the clear if they get even more penalty, and the race leader is behind them as well so they're gonna have to move out of the way at some point Sergio's coming up to lap them oh yeah Cars in fifth and sixth, having to move out of the way for the leader. That's how much of a lead Sergio has. Because he's going to have to move off like right now. And yeah, if he doesn't, then yeah, he's over yeah he does. Yeah. Oh, that's that's a shame. That's well, a shame. it might be an opportunity though if he can stay on the back of Sergio and then Jippo moves out of the way. Jippo's going to have to do Gippo's it pretty carefully as Anonymous gets himself a penalty Anonymous for cutting the chicane. Uh, Radios gets out of the way of both of them, Radios or all of them. Radios is two laps down, I believe, though. Yeah, he or is. Yeah, he's a long way behind. So Anonymous going to try and stay on the back of Sergios. Oh, as he hits the wall on the exit of the swimming pool section. Round Raskas, they go. Vance, meanwhile, has is, he is not catching him. He's not catching Michael in, uh, in time enough. Or he has, a, he has some more laps to do so, but... Um, I know he has more pace than this, so he's going to have to make something happen. But Michael, so far, has just driven really great. Yeah, he has. Obviously quite good in the wet. Jippo does let Sergios pass without any drama, so no opportunity for Anonymous. He wasn't able to stay close enough to Sergios. Jippo might be able to get a bit of a toe here, but in the end, I don't think it's going to really matter since it's Monaco. He's just going to get a bit of uh, turbulent air yep. off yep. of it, and then that's going to slow him down a bit. It's uh, nigh on impossible to pass unless you make a major mistake. As we see, uh, he is keeping up with them, though. Yeah, I imagine Serge. I mean, Sergios will be taking it pretty easy. I would have thought. He, yeah, he's a full 52 seconds ahead. Yep. His strategy was uh, absolutely perfect. Well, I mean, yeah, like like I said, if you can if you can qualify on the front row on the ultras, then uh, that's that's your race pretty much set. That's uh, such a good qualifying performance that has set up set up and this race for him. And to make it make the matter even better for him like it began to rain so he didn't even have to do that stop in the first place he yep. just hit with everyone so that's how he gained so much time yeah because everyone behind him essentially oh, it was Jippo Jippo clattered across the second part of the swimming pool section didn't get a penalty for it he was certainly will have got a warning as uh, Anonymous lies in wait in P6 we've got eight laps to go Sergio seven laps to go now as Sergio crosses the start finish line to start lap 33 he's 53 seconds ahead of Hugos in second and uh, Michael just behind five seconds or so behind with Bantz uh, two seconds behind him but Bantz of course with all of those penalties I'm sure he's got more than Michael so uh, he's gonna have to well probably that's why Bantz is not catching Michael I imagine Bantz has probably settled for fourth because of all the penalties that he's got I don't think he's going to give it up. Uh, if I were him, I'd just try and go for it, maybe. Because I think Michael has a handful of penalties, too, possibly. Um, I'm not entirely sure, but... Um, yeah, I guess you never know. I mean, I've, I've not seen... Oh, it's Bantz again. Ooh, Cuts oh, across. Ma oh, he clouts the wall. Bantz hit the wall, certainly. I don't know if Michael did as well. So, yeah, he's obviously pushing quite hard. Might say too hard. Oh, Anonymous again, just about a second behind Jippo again, not really able to make any sort of inroads. Don't know what the penalty situation is between these two, but uh, and of course they won't know either. But uh, Anonymous, oh, Jippo made, yeah, Jippo made a mistake in Raskas. Anonymous oh, not quite able to get, good. yeah, not enough traction unfortunately. Oh, but he has got it. He's got the traction here though. Slow. Uh, he's not got him though. That's so much more traction there down the main straight. I don't know if that was an engine mode as well or a battery mode for Anonymous, but uh, certainly uh, caught Jippo so. very quickly. Has a lot of ERS on yeah, I don't, I don't know. He certainly, I guess it was just traction then because it, it's not, it's not full. Presumably, it's not 100% throttle even oh, down the straight. Oh, Ben's going wide though again at New Bell. Uh, did he get a corner cutting? Okay, no, he didn't, but he blocks up really hard into the bargain. And now, oh, 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 my goodness. He's <laughs> losing it all over the place now. Vance, oh, that's so, that's so um, disappointing. Yeah, he is, oh, he is losing the rear end all over the place here into swimming pool. And, um, yeah, he was right on Michael's tail again. But, um, 
he just couldn't get it in time so well, Bantz is... Uh, but, uh, but, oh, Michael slowed again, though. Yeah, he was very slow. Bantz is babysitting his one-year-old niece, and uh, his one-year-old niece, I'm sure, is crying in his ear. <laughs> as uh, <laughs> Ocean Chief uh, Ocean Chief hates Revo as well. That's uh, that's oh, breaking news, oh, Michael! Oh, oh, he hit the wall hard on the exit of Sandoval, and Bantz hit him hard as oh, well. Oh, that was so unfortunate. So Bantz... Third for the time being. W at what cost to his front wing, though? Oh, I see. Has also gotten past, uh, Gippo. Oh, he has. We didn't see that on track, but uh, that certainly did happen. Oh, and, oh. And Michael and um, Vance gets a five-second stop go penalty. So that will have been and an he, illegal he overtake. Yellow, yeah, so illegal oh, overtake. Yeah, that's uh, that's what happened. He got himself that's a penalty for it. So unfortunate. So well, it's another it's another one onto the onto the list of penalties that Bantz has for this race. He's got quite a few, and it's uh, a question now of whether Michael can stay within range of him. Michael will have a lot of damage though from that incident. I'm sure. We'll stay on board um, with Michael here a little bit. Like, much wing, uh, luckily, but yeah, there might be some missing on the right end. I can only see the left, and he is uh, mm. he is going a bit slow. You can see a bit of understeer. Yep. But um, Jippo, meanwhile, is probably going to try and go back it and get um, Anonymous, who is also driven pretty well this race. But yeah, well, Jippo falling off the back a little bit. Hugo are in their own race. Yeah, well, Hugo's. I mean, Hugo's particularly has uh, has done such a good job of coming back from that mishap on yeah. lap one, qualified on pole position, hit the wall right here, in fact, at Massenay, and uh, manages to get himself back up to second place. It's been a really, really good drive from him. Michael, though, really struggling, and I think he hit the wall again there on the exit of Sandoval. I think I caught, just caught the tail end of that. He's now five seconds off the back of Bantz and understeering into the wall at Massane 2. Yeah, I, I think if Bantz pits, he will still be um, in fourth place. Unless uh, Michael spins again or something, because I don't think Anonymous is far enough at, or close enough to do something about it. So Michael, again... I mean, Anonymous is 25 seconds, but there's, what, four laps to go? The leader... Where is the leader? The leader is coming oh, up to... Host, host. Oh, no! Did I don't... No, I again. don't have that. I don't have that. So, uh, I wonder... I, okay, it, I, it may just be a glitch for me, but um, I see the migrating host thing. I don't know if Ocean... Or if, I, I believe Vance is hosting, right? Uh, I don't know, actually. I don't know who's, who's hosting. Um... It probably isn't Bantz, because Bantz has got internet problems right now. It probably is Ocean Chief, but I don't know. Um, well, I don't have that message, so I don't know if it's just uh, if it's just a client-side yeah, thing for you. Fingers um, crossed that it is. I'm, I'm, I'm just going to ignore it, because everyone seems to be racing fine, so... Yeah, yeah. Um, either way, I know the order here, in case something does happen. Um, and yeah. there's three laps to go, so... Um, it's looking like everything is basically settled because the Jippo's fallen back now from an, and he's missing wing too. I can see he's missing a bit of front wing. So um, what he okay, might oh. end up doing is um oh but into the wall on the exit of. Uh, he's just trying to overtake Michael actually, even though he's a lap down. Michael just might let him pass. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty sensible. Michael yeah, struggling so much. He's got more pace than him. He's uh, seven and a half now off the back of Bantz, and I, want, I wonder what the penalty situation is. Bantz has got a lot of penalties, so he might have to be further ahead even than that to yeah, actually finish ahead of Michael. Because yeah. Michael is really slow, yep. and he's got yep. a few more laps to do so. Um, but I'm, I'm not too sure. I think, I mean, he's guaranteed fourth, I think, because I don't think, um, I think Anonymous has some penalties too, and Bantz has like, I think, four of them, and... Uh, Anonymous may have two. Something's up with my gaps. They're not moving. Uh, the gaps? Yeah. I think no, mine are moving too. Uh, I can see Hugo's moving. Yeah, Bantz is. Well, I can see. Bantz I can see the. Ca yeah, I can see the cars moving, but I don't know. I think um, Bantz might have desynced. I don't know quite. I don't know quite what's happened to be honest, but yeah, everyone. Like none of the gaps are moving for me at all, so something something weird is happening. For me, they're moving. Okay, and my, well, Bantz is certainly more than seven and a half seconds ahead of Michael oh, now. Oh, they just disappeared though. Yeah, they did for me too. Oh no, no, they're back now. They're back now. Oh, what, what happened to Hugo? Hugo is it in Lowe's hairpin? No, I think I think this is a desync. Oh, uh, mine, yeah, 
yeah, I think there's a glitch. Yeah, I think this is a desync. Yeah, there's something wrong. So I don't think I don't it's think. Up. Yeah, I don't think that's real. I think Hugos is still second. Bance is still third. Yeah, it's showing like Bance and Hugos are just moving all over the place, and Anonymous and Jippo moved up, and then Tipsy's moved up, and now Sir Joss has moved down. <laughs> so yeah, I'm I don't know. Watch the onboards here. So I think we're still on. Last time this happened in Azerbaijan. Oh, there's the migrating. Oh, yeah, there's the mi yeah, there's she's the she's migrating left. host uh, message. Oh no! Okay, we got that again. So I think that's the race over now. I think it probably is. Well, Sergios. Uh, oh, I mean, no, whatever no, happened, no, Sergios no, 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 has won. Answers the host. Answers the host. Okay. So, no, no, okay. it just out for as far as we know, the lap counter is accurate. The lap counter didn't move for a couple of uh, well, till the end of the race in Azerbaijan for us. So uh, I don't know if that's the case here as well. But Sergios is going to be coming through very shortly if it's correct to start his last lap and i think everything else is pretty much settled across the field yes. my my board's fixed up too now so um i can see uh yeah it's well i can't i can't see any gaps unfortunately um, um some of the gaps aren't showing because some of the move like they just it just evened itself out once ocean chief left okay reason. i think just somebody had to leave for it to fix so Hugos isn't uh, so, um, Hugos isn't a lap down on Sergios though, right? He's uh, um, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, um, yeah. So Michael, yeah, I guess the gaps are fixing themselves. So Michael's 19 behind Vance, and that might be the sort of gap that Vance needs to actually get that third place on the track. If he can build it a bit more, yeah, definitely. Um, did he serve the stop go penalty? Uh, no, he hasn't. So it'll be. I think it. I think it I does still only give it. I, d I think it does still only give it as a five-second penalty if you get a penalty like that. But uh, I don't know. We'll have to see. Um, he has several corner cutting penalties as well, so it might be something like 15 seconds worth. But I think that's more than. As he hops across the chicane once again, I think that's more than the gap that he's got. As Michael decides, he doesn't particularly want to take the Nouvelle chicane, so he goes straight across it. But uh, in any case, the winner of this race is going to be winning it very shortly. El Sergios around Raskas, around Anthony Noge, an absolutely dominating performance. He's been ahead the whole race. He's won it by almost a minute. <laughs> and he has taken the checkered flag for another race win for El Sergios. Absolutely commanding performance. Pretty that much. So good from him. Yeah, first lap to the end. Fantastically. Uh, um, the pit stop or the um the strategy, the strategy was actual, was actually perfect. Um, his drive as well, and oh, okay, that's <laughs> copy just hit him in the back. Um, if you saw that. Or oh no, that, I didn't. Well, they 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 both out. yeah they both finished the race, so uh, I guess oh, okay, it's just so the AI. That's, that's funny. Yeah. Meanwhile, um, Hugos is gonna come home here in second place. Um, a whole minute behind Sergios to put in perspective how ridiculous Sergios did today. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but at the same time, having had a complete disaster on lap one, where he qualified on yeah. pole position, hit the wall on the outside, and was basically, what, P17 at, at the end of lap one? And, yeah, it was lap one, and uh, Hugos now P2 from last place. Fantastic drive him as well. And Bance, um... I mean, there were a lot of there were a lot of incidents here and there since it's Monaco, but Vance <laughs> drove really well today as well to come up from sixth to third and to get that podium place. Um, yeah, great job to him. Um, unless he unless that penalty comes into play here, unless Michael no, can get it. No, uh, there's there's the podium, absolutely no chance. He uh, hits uh, the no, slow Sergios. Is that? Um, no, Michael's already finished. Oh, Michael was a lap down, so oh, he's okay, yeah, uh, he's finished the race. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, fourth, so Michael. only only and three people finish on the lead lap, and uh, that was the that was the state of the gap at the end of the race between Sergios and everyone else. But uh, fantastic oh, drive from Sergios, and yeah, Bance does keep the third place. Good job to him. Good job to everyone um, who finished. There was some good fights and everything. That was a really good race. Um, yeah, yeah. Well, there's the at Monaco. there's the list <laughs> of penalties. Yeah, Bance had 14 seconds worth of penalties. Uh, oh, he had wow. the the yeah. most of the the most of the front runners certainly but uh well i mean that's what a typical monaco field looks like particularly one in the wet everyone strung out and only what 13 finished no 12 finishes 
well, 11 finishes because I'm not going to count Etnik TRN who and disconnected on lap one. Down. It like everyone had a penalty except Sergios. Sergios did not That's... have a single penalty. That is That's very, very impressive. Really impressive. Fastest lap of the race. Won Meanwhile, it from um, the front row and no penalties. That's a big blow, though, to um, Speedy, um, his championship. That was really disappointing. Um, he was doing pretty decently, especially considering he's on a pad and he had a lot less pace, mm. chances are, compared to everyone else. But, um, yeah, that's a shame. Now, Sergios may or may not be the man in the lead of this championship, so... Yep, I think he almost certainly is, because, yeah, he's gained a full 25 on, on Speedy there. And yeah, I wonder with that incident with Bounce as well, whether the stewards are going to be looking at that at the end of the race for Speedy. It looked, uh, certainly looked like he was the person who was culpable for that one, but we'll, uh, we'll let the stewards sort that out. But, uh, great race anyway. Thank you. Thank you for joining me, Triton. It's been, uh, it's been really me. fun. Um, pleasure. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> and, uh, we'll be back to, back with normal service resuming, I think, next week, Timo, who's, uh, not going to be celebrating his uh, friend's birthday anymore next week and uh, <laughs> we'll be back for the French Grand Prix is it the French Grand Prix no it's Canadian uh, it's Canada, Grand Prix Canadian Grand Prix next uh, next week so join us for that thanks again Triton and see you next time thank you